What's going on, y'all? It's Trinity. Back to the kitchen. We messages are for the collective. All right. Keep in mind, these readings are just general. They're timeless. Take what resonates. Leave what does not. If nothing shall resonate here with you today, please just leave it. All right. Let's see. Let's get a message here. Ancestors, angels, a message for the collective, please. Sagittarius is energy. Messages for the collective, please. So we got temperance out for the first card, okay? What's going on here, please? The world. Queen of Pentacles. It's a completion of a cycle, okay? Let's see. What's, what, what is this here with the world? What's going on here with the collective? <clears throat> the devil, Capricorn. And then the Ace of Wands. So some of you guys are coming out of a very um, toxic era of your life. Okay, I'm just getting it. For some of y'all, somebody's trying to pull this energy back out of you. But you're in complete balance and a harmonious uh, time of your life. Page of Wands at the bottom of the deck with the moon. <clears throat> Some of you guys, um, there's somebody that's coming to reveal you a secret. But this is to throw off your balance, so be very careful here. Somebody wants to illuminate something, but this is definitely to disturb your peace. So for some of you guys, if you um, recently completed a cycle, this can have anything to do with any addiction in your life, any toxic situation in your life. If somebody comes to you trying to illuminate um, something devilish that's transpired, shh, remember that you guys already completed this cycle. Because for some of y'all, um, it's somebody in your energy that wants to um, invoke some sort of energy out of you. The Ace of Wands to the devil. This could be sex. Some of you guys could have overcame a sex addiction or something like that. Or this is like um, somebody wanting to come and illuminate um, something about your past in regards to um, somebody who you was binded to. Somebody's definitely want to come towards you. For some of you guys, um, just be very careful. If you guys have completed a cycle with the ex or something like that, somebody's carrying something here that's not 
something's not not good um this person could want to come back and somebody definitely ain't got good intentions look at this poison on this wine <clears throat> and i feel like here somebody knows that you're done with them the devil you guys could be seeing this person in your sleep um something's happening like in your sleep i don't know somebody's revealing something to you Somebody's trying to reveal something to you. Shh, huh? Yeah, on the front. Somebody's trying to reveal something to you in a sleep. Or it's like somebody's trying to attach an entity to you in your sleep. All right. And this is somebody who you completed a cycle with. The King of Pentacles. Could be an earth sign here. Somebody from your past. Six of Cups. This could be somebody in your family or... Like, um, this got something to do with a memory here, sweet memories or something like that. I'm hearing sweet nothing. See a king of wands in reverse next to the, um, six of cups. This is a karmic here. The king of wands is one who in reverse somebody, this is somebody who never protects you or something like that. This, this is somebody who does not use protection. Just period. This is a fool. Somebody who takes risks. All right, Eight of Wands without any thinking here. Knight of Cups in reverse. Some sweet nothings, all right? <clears throat> Somebody wants to gift you something. And for some of y'all, it's meant to break your heart. Look, with the Hermit, this, this is... Somebody wants you to think about something that was heartbreaking. Just period, all right? That's what I'm getting... The King of Pentacles is one who's grounded, though, one who's stable. For some of y'all, this could be an ex-husband or something like that. This could be a business owner. Um, this is somebody here who is very stable. So for some of y'all, if you are in some sort of tight situation or something like that, it's like somebody wants to come and assist you, be some sort of helping hand, or just know something in regards to sex. Could be a Capricorn in specific. Something is a no-go. But only you would know your situation here. All right, <clears throat> look, they get a king of wands in reverse, king of pentacles to the king of wands in reverse. This is a low vibing masculine. All right, this is one who has no control over their emotions. Somebody uses their finances or possibly sexual energy to get whatever they want. With that king of wands in reverse, um... Y'all could be dealing with a Sagittarius masculine. Um, could could be a it could be any fire sign though. This is somebody who's in a vulnerable state right now, or it's something that somebody's trying to do in regards to you. Something's ineffective. This could even be business. Something something that they're doing something that they're doing for business. Something's ineffective. Or something. We got the two of pentacles right there with the um the moon. Somebody's doing something in a dream state. <clears throat> this is somebody wanting you to question, like a re question your reality or question. They want you to question your beliefs, like what you know of them or like what they done to you in the past with that king of wands. This is somebody who's feeling powerless right now. All right, very weak and vulnerable. This could be some sort of dictator or something like that. Look, Five of Cups, remorseful and regret with the Five of Cups. Somebody's like reviewing the past. Six of Cups, bottom of the deck. And something to do with time. A decision that they made out of vulnerability or weakness. Some of y'all just got something to do with a sex addiction. Some of y'all walked away in the nick of time or something like that, but something somebody did out of vulnerability, them feeling powerless or something like that, weak, a, a breakup could be significant, five of cups. Somebody's been grieving over like a breakup or a couple felt relationships. This is somebody who went out on the edge after like a, a couple of bad breakups or something like that. Somebody could even be grieving deaths or something. The lovers, the two of cups, the king of cups, somebody's very emotional, uh, very emotional about the past and um 
this is somebody here who's very weak with their sexual energy. So for some of y'all, this is somebody who recently got out of a relationship, had a bad breakup or something. This person's sleeping around. A Capricorn feminine here could have infected this masculine or something like that. For some of y'all, it's, it's a feminine who infected this, uh, yeah, a relationship that went off like over is what got this masculine in a very toxic energy but i do see here it could have been a capricorn specifically i see this here um this person could have infected this masculine somebody's like going to get checked out right now or something like that or for some of y'all king of pentacles with the ace of wands something could be like a work thing Something has something to do with a work project or something. It's got something to do with somebody's lifestyle. Somebody lives a very fast life. All right. We got adjudication. Something could be in court at this time. All right. And for some of y'all, somebody could be losing a lot of money or something. For others of you guys, um, yeah, this got something to do with a divorce. Somebody went off the edge here. A lover could have moved away or something like that. Somebody went away. Yeah, this is what somebody's in their head about. Adjudication, high honor, marriage. This could be somebody here who you wanted to marry or something like that. For some of y'all, this person split. They left you and they ran into somebody who matched their energy. All right. And, and somebody could be losing like a lot of money or something like that. Let's go ahead and see that. Give me one on the temperance. For others of you guys, like I said, this could be an ex, somebody from the past. Somebody's going through a divorce. Somebody wants to come towards you for a higher level commitment. But for some of y'all, this person needs to provide you paperwork or something like that. Or you need to be like, if this person, yeah, this person needs to provide you paperwork. We got the page of pentacles here. <clears throat> I see somebody here studying you or somebody has a picture of you. Somebody's watching you and... They're sending you some sort of energy. This could be through the internet. Somebody's sending you energy. Queen of Pentacles to the Four of Wands to Ace of Cups. Somebody wants to marry you. Somebody want to put some work in. Eight of Pentacles, the star. This is all good energy. But for some of y'all here, somebody needs to go get tested or somebody needs to test. There's also some sort of like toxic attachment that this king of pentacles could possibly have with this devil ace of wands yeah two of cups somebody got like a um somebody's tied to something or somebody in some way shape or form and it's like this person wants somebody wants to illuminate something to you seven of swords to the hangman they want you to know something the knight of pentacles Two of Cups speaks about um, mutual attraction. Somebody's like showing somebody like a picture or it's like somebody's having a conversation with somebody want to marry you. <clears throat> For some of y'all, this person had been in multiple marriages or this is somebody who, who married multiple times or something like that. They could utilize like the same minister or somebody could have like one minister or something. Somebody utilizes the same person. And I see that like this, this judge or this minister, somebody's looking at somebody like you again. We got the Empress in reverse. Are you sure this is the right one? It's something like that. Somebody likes like low vibing. I'm also hearing promiscuous um, like women. And it, it, I feel like at this time, somebody's trying to like switch their type or something because their type ain't been working. Look, the lovers, the five of wands, the eight of cups to the chariot in reverse. Somebody type ain't been working. Four swords. And something could be affecting somebody's health. So for some of y'all, um, this person is really stressed out in regards to you right now. I do feel like with the four swords, you guys are in like non-communication with this person or it's some sort of block here. Is an attachment that somebody has. See, look, the four cups to the ace of swords or somebody receives some sort of truth or it's like somebody want to call a truce, but look where you at with the queen of swords in reverse. The sun. 
Let's see. <clears throat> I'm also seeing if somebody is like living in a home, they're married, it, somebody is like flaunting your picture or they're showing another lover or something or they telling you they'll do something to prove something's over. It's something here going on where somebody wants to prove something to you. Somebody want to prove something. You could feel like somebody feels like what they say or tell you is not enough. This is somebody who lied in the past. Queen of Pentacles, the Four of Swords to the Three of Swords or something like that. <clears throat> but for some of y'all, this person knows something's completely over. Y'all could have an ex here who's watching you online. I don't know if you recently posted pictures with a lover or something like that. Somebody's watching you online with this lover. Somebody's watching you. If you left this person and you're in a relationship. Somebody could have even seen somebody propose to you or gave you some sort of ring. Somebody gave you something here and something's posted online. Somebody's watching this here. And I do feel like here's with the devil. Somebody is very toxic. They're obsessed. Or this is somebody who's very possessive. Y'all got somebody possessive watching you. That's the word. Somebody who's very possessive here with that devil card. <clears throat> yeah, the hermit, all eyes on you, this lover, this relationship, or somebody is angry because they feel out about you and a lover. We got Virgo, we got Capricorn, we got Sagittarius here, any fire sign, masculine, could be an earth sign, but somebody is watching somebody online with a partner, all right? And look where this person at with this, this five of swords. Somebody could be trying to locate somebody here. With the five of swords or this is like i'm gonna get and get energy or you're gonna accept this from me by any means necessary this is a one at all cost energy that's watching you here okay or this is a one at all cost that's watching somebody else we ain't got no feminines that came out but i do feel like this devil ace of wands is a feminine here <clears throat> let's see though what's the uh The, they, 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 there she go the empress in reverse somebody could be a Taurus or a libra it could be a, a virgo here somebody's watching somebody here they got some new information or somebody's going all out here to get some sort of information something's being illuminated to somebody that's bringing like a beast out of somebody we got the four of swords i'm hearing do not disturb some of y'all could have recently had your phone on do not disturb you didn't take a call or something like that here. Somebody's pissed off about that. Or um, for some of y'all, just be careful. Does this person have keys to your home? Or um, somebody wants to do something while you're asleep. Or somebody, somebody watches you as you sleep. If you're home with this lover, just be careful. It's like somebody's like watching somebody as they're asleep. Or somebody could be rejecting somebody for passion. Somebody feel like somebody's giving it to somebody else. Or it's something here. But I feel like while somebody is asleep, somebody's going through somebody's phone. And they see something here that they don't like. <clears throat> Some of y'all, somebody could have been in court. There could be some sort of protective order on somebody here with the seven of wands. To the higher client or. Yeah, somebody's blocking something out. Is is an order of protection or something with the higher client? Something's written, something solidified with the seven of swords. I feel like somebody's trying to find a way around a protective order or a restraining order or something like that or. Somebody, somebody has their defenses up with the Seven of Wands to the Four of Swords. But for some of y'all, if this person's trying to contact you and it like ethers here, something's blocked. Somebody's like trying to attach something to you, the Ace of Wands to the Devil with the Seven of Wands. Yeah, Seven of Swords, very sneaky energy here. This is somebody here who practices like, or they know something about spiritual influences or something like that. This is somebody here who's spiritual. You don't know this here. Seven of Wands, the Seven of Swords with the Hangman. We got seven, seven here. Somebody could have the tattoo number seven, birth month number seven. Seven could be in a social security number. Address could have a seven in it. Something to do with the number seven here. 
Somebody's doing something very sneaky here. And I feel like this is in a dream state with the hangman. Why you're resting? The hangman to the four of swords, to the five of swords. Somebody's doing something while somebody sleep. Some of you guys could, could be waking up out of your sleep between the hours of 4 or like 2 to 4 a.m., 2 to 5. It's like every time this person does something, you wake up like this. Somebody's trying to attach something to you. What's, what's the uh, Seven of Swords with the hangman over here? What is this here? Somebody like found out some sort of information or... Whatever somebody's trying to do, if they're failing, is unsuccessful here with the Six of Wands in reverse. Or y'all got somebody going behind your back here. If, if you do have a committed partner or somebody who's interested in you, somebody's doing something behind your back in regards to this lover. So for some of y'all, y'all got somebody contacting y'all. This could be through the phone. This could be um, through email here. Somebody's doing something to block something. There could also be some sort of investigator with the... Um, with the hermit here, there's an investigator. Somebody's paying somebody, page of pentacles with the hermit to like spy on you and a lover or um, this person's paid to watch you, get evidence in regards to you and a lover. Somebody's doing something here. For some of y'all, this is somebody here who's like trying to get a case in regards to alimony or something like that. For others of you guys, this is like, um, if somebody was to find out who you was dating, somebody would be marked. We got the moon. <laughs> I'm not going to take it, though. Somebody's, like, marking all your lovers. Anybody who's interested or anything, somebody, it's like this person's automatically marked. they like, no, this person's mine with the devil. Somebody's very possessive, all right? This person could be running your lovers away. And I could be speaking to a twin flame with the sun, somebody who's a part of the 144,000. Y'all got somebody here who wants to be a part of that journey, and they're not. See, look, the Ten of Wands, they're burdened. Because for some of y'all, somebody's trying to break a spiritual tie with you. And a, yeah, look, the strength. Somebody's trying to break a tie with you and a twin or a lover. Something got something to do with time. Somebody knows that, like, time is up. We got the Three of Wands. You completely walked away from something or... These are like two people. Y'all could have at least two masculines here that you left behind. Look, with the lovers <clears throat> to go towards this emperor, this twin. Ten of Wands speaks about obstacles, delays, struggles. Something's getting harder and harder for somebody to do something here. And I also get for some of y'all, somebody's health is failing. Six of Wands with the Ten of Wands uh, with the King of wands in reverse somebody's like somebody's health is declining the ten of swords we got two tens there is definitely a completion of a cycle two of swords the three of swords the eight of wands so for some of y'all if somebody's health is declining or something's happening to this person this person plans to reach out and this is like somebody wants to play on your sympathy this is to have you run to them and end something that's supposed to be coming in look the fool the nine of wands the eight of cups Somebody wants you paranoid or scared in regards to something. This is somebody here who ended multiple relationships for you. Look, Ten of Cups, and these could have been happy relationships, but this is still a one who's not ready for commitment. The Five of Wands with the Page of Swords. This is somebody who's very obsessive and possessive. They like to watch you, Queen of Pentacles, the Justice. Somebody's watching you get justice, transforming, growing learning that could be speaking to a very stable feminine right now you getting good news or it's a good time in your life and somebody wants to stop your movement and i do feel like somebody's rushing in something got something to do with sex somebody feels like if they attach something to you you stop or you ain't gonna be able to move forward let's get one here something your era of like passion based fun irrational impulsive something has completely ended and this is triggering somebody here all right Somebody's thinking about what they could have had with you. The hangman, the lovers with the Ten of Cups. And that's the truth. And they're also wanting to get the truth on who you're sleeping with. Some of y'all, this is a cancer. 
We got the Seven of Pentacles with the Three of Swords. Somebody been waiting for you to cut ties or to break here with somebody. This could be your twin, a lover, or somebody who you're married. This is like somebody waiting around for a marriage or something to end and you still don't look at this person or something like that. And I feel like somebody's having a fit. One more. Give me one on the truth. Some of y'all, you got the truth about here. Somebody who somebody was dealing with here. And Aquarius could be significant. Or somebody knows that you've healed from here. Somebody attached. Quiet down. Somebody attached a sickness or something to you. Somebody know you healed from this. And you're receiving justice. Somebody don't like this. Give me one on this uh this six of wands in reverse with the ten of wands. What is this over here? Expectation in reverse. Give me one next to this expectation in reverse. Some of y'all, somebody is struggling or something. They want you to create a pathway for them. You don't have to be the most stable, but yeah, look, poverty. You don't have to be the most stable, but somebody's looking at you because of the energy that you carry, all right? Yeah, you could be very mature. I told you somebody watch you change or transform right before your eyes. Somebody knows that you're preparing for some of y'all to be a wife. And this is to somebody of, of high honor. Sudden um, wealth. Somebody's status is about to change. Somebody's life is about to change here. And this main male, I don't know what they was expecting to take you to court for. Courthouse in reverse. Or somebody could be in court. Somebody's like... It could be like something to do with alimony or children. We got change and we got child here. Something changed in regards to somebody's finances, in regards to a child. Somebody could be finding out that they have a child. Yeah, look, message of concern. Some of y'all could have broke up with this person because they you found out like they were about to have a baby or something like that. This stopped the journey for some of y'all. For others of you guys, somebody's like getting a message from a lover. They're pregnant or look, message. In reverse, and then we got changed. Somebody changed their number, or this is what they're planning to do. Somebody had a rendezvous with a lover. They did not use protection. For some of y'all, somebody about to go to jail for child support. This is somebody who's not working, and is a vindictive feminine, main feminine, who wants to get paid here. Pathway, despair, concern in reverse, and great fortune. This is, for some of y'all, a karmic or something. Some of y'all, this is not a karmic. This is somebody who just wants to get paid um for their child or you know somebody's like a not active father or something for some of y'all this is a false person now this is somebody who look and look somebody's sick somebody could have met a false person and somebody stole from them or this this was this feminine's intentions so that's why i said they met somebody like them and it's like this this feminine had intentions and this masculine had intentions and both of their intentions are falling through what's the outcome Neither one of them could meet either their expectation expectations. We got judgment. And this was this was like this is what the most high needed to put these two through for change or something like that. This person have a change of mind and a feminine they were dealing with. So this is a feminine who's not working or they use men for money. Somebody gotta go get a job or something. This is this is what they were not expecting. Something was all to do with manipulation. Could be a water sign, a Virgo, or a um a Gemini here. Five of cups, crying over spilled milk. Strength. Somebody's having to pull strength or something. Be resilient in a certain situation. All right. Could be a Leo. Somebody's grieving. They was expecting to get something out of somebody. For some of y'all, this feminine found out you were connected to this masculine. Something got something to do with a competition. Five of swords. Somebody feels that they could hold you back, hold your connection back. Or for some of y'all, if you're in a public light, you got money. Four of wands, very stable. This is a feminine here who, especially if you're married, they thought that they would attach to your masculine with a baby and that you would, maybe they would leave, maybe that masculine would leave you and they would get alimony off of you. For some of you guys, this is like, um, she's going to help take care of this baby, King of Wands. And somebody's pulling back. This is, is something, the complete opposite is happening. Somebody's pulling back from this feminine. Somebody's, yeah, look, eight of swords, but they're binded in some way, shape, or form. So for some of y'all, this person's trying to pull you into a scenario like this. I feel like you know this, and this is why you're walking away. Eight of cups to something here. Look, two of cups, ace of wands, the hermit, isolation, queen of swords. I feel like you got your facts. You know the truth. 
about this third party. Something has been illuminated. Look, six of wands, something could be public. Or like I said, somebody's like, somebody made something official. Something's online. All right. And I feel like here, you know, something was meant to trigger y'all. So if you separated from somebody toxic, somebody could have recently gotten married. Something's online. A friend or a family member wants to come towards you here. This is to disturb your healing. Isolate from this person. Somebody wants to trigger you. We got new friendship. Some of y'all need to be healing. Could have something to do with inner child healing. This could be a childhood friend who you isolated from. Somebody wants to trigger you with something because they know what's to come into your life. We got open up. We got life changing decision. And then we got twin flame. Some of y'all are influencing a twin flame or a twin flame is wanting to come and take a risk. All right. Keep showing yourself self love. I feel like that's what you're doing. You're calling in your twin flame. All right. Somebody know this. And it's somebody. It, oh, look at that. Oh, somebody angry. They auntie. It's somebody from your past who's trying to come in. This person plans to trigger you. This is to stop your healing, your healing journey for this twin flame or whoever this person is that's coming into your life. All right, so just take note of that. Let's get one of these. We got loneliness and connection. Somebody's connecting back to source. For some of y'all, somebody's suppressing something. They want to tell you something. Some of y'all found source in, in a period of isolation. I also feel like this is where you connect with your twin. Some of y'all, the, the connection is 5D. It hasn't come down to the 3D yet. Somebody's trying to disturb something. This is like somebody trying to get something that you're not speaking or you haven't spoken. Somebody's trying to like pull some sort of energy out of you or they want to put the blinders over your eyes. If this is an ex, they're telling you that you can't find nobody better. Or this is what somebody's doing in the spiritual realm. They want you to think that they're it. We got love and hurt. This is why you're showing yourself self-love or something here. Somebody's like trying to study your behaviors at this time. They're trying to figure out how they can like play some sort of trick on you or something like that. Something's not working. This person's not even able to reach you in the ethers at this time here. Something's a block or it's like a glitch. We got cooperation instead of competition. Which yours is yours? No one can take it from you. There's no need to compete as there's abundance for all to... For all, you have complete access to unlimited abundance for yourself and to share with others. With cooperative partners, you can accomplish anything. See, obstacles and blockages are lifted. Let's get some of these here. Let's get at least seven of these initials, your name, the karmic, or whoever this masculine is, the twin flame, all parties involved. Let's get some initials here. We're going to do seven since seven is the number here. We have D. We have A. We have Q. We have P. This could be somebody who said, give me some debt or something like that. We got X. Somebody nickname could be X, P, Q, D, A. That's five here. Let's get two more. We have K. We have O. Any more here, Spirit? That's the seven. Is there any more here? We have C, J, and S. So C, J could be significant. Oh, one more fell L. So C... L, K, S, J, P, X, A, D, and Q. All right. Somebody could have been adopted here. Somebody name could be Jack, J, 
A C K S O. Doc, somebody name could be Doc, somebody could be a doctor. If this is a masculine, this masculine used to run to the store, they got you pads, or this is the type of person that will run to the store and get you pads. We got laps, somebody could be on track, somebody could be a runner. You could you used to sit on this person's lap. We have sack. Could be a childhood friend used to run in the pillowcases or something. We had PJ sleepover. Somebody used to sleep over with or something to do with a sleepover. We also have packs. Somebody runs in packs or something. CAO. Somebody could work at a welfare um welfare or something like that. We also have jock. Somebody's jocking you or somebody's trying to steal your style. Mimic. Docs. Something to do with Word document. Somebody could be into administrative or something like that. You could have received socks for Christmas. This could resonate with you. We also have C-L-A-P-S, clips. Somebody's like burning. Somebody got the clips. All right. Somebody could be Korean here or something. X-A-O. That could be a last name. Somebody aced the test here, though. I'm going to go ahead and leave it there, y'all. Any of this resonates today, like, share, and subscribe. Take care.